Hey guys, this is Abel, and today we're going to look at how to use our controller's drum pad to trigger MIDI notes to play a different patch there than what we're playing from the keys. So by default, it's also triggering the same uh, patch or instrument that the keys are playing. So let's go to layout window. I already added four on-screen drum pads but you can add as many as you want and maybe resize them just like that but uh, for the tutorial I only want to use four so now we're gonna have to assign them to our physical drum pad select the on screen control hit assign and push the drum pad on your MIDI controller do the same thing for the rest of them and we're done so now the problem is that uh, I'm hitting the drum pad and the on screen keyboard is also showing that the keys are being pressed this means that uh, we have to specify what MIDI channel the keyboard will receive MIDI messages from so click on the on screen keyboard hit assign and play the the keys play press any keys on your controller so now we assign this to channel 1 from the same keyboard channel 1 and the drum pad from the same keyboard and channel 2 so now we can go at the concert level now the drum pads are not sending or playing uh, the same patch anymore so now you have to decide where you want to create your instrument if you want it at the patch level or you want it at the concert level the difference is that when you create a patch at the patch level that patch will only be available at that patch when you switch to a different patch it won't be there as opposed to creating it at the concert level which means that it will be like a global patch it will be available at any patch level that you go so then we're going to create a patch at the concert level hit the plus button or sign and create hit create so now you can go up here and load your preferred uh, channel strip settings uh, but what I want to do right now is just copy one of the paths copy channel strip settings now go back at the concert level uh, and then paste that channel strip setting set it to 0 dB now check your MIDI input and you don't want your keyboard here it said none uh, otherwise you will be playing that patch from your keys also so now let's map the on screen drum pads to that channel strip so click on it and then select the channel strip which is the worship path and then I want it to send MIDI notes and here I want it to send C3 I want it to trigger C3 when I hit that drum pad okay sounds good this one do the same MIDI notes and then D3 now next one worship path MIDI notes D3 gotta be somewhere here and then and, and then this one the worship path MIDI notes F3 it's gotta be here so now let's go to a patch level doesn't matter to if you switch the patches and then the patch will be there
All right, guys. So that's how you assign your controller drum pad to trigger MIDI notes and play a different instrument. Hope that helps. Uh, make sure to check out the description to see more uh, tutorials and different products I have available for main stage. All right, that's all for now. See you in the next video.